And your roof is a hip roof, which is this. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is stick an I beam in it like this, okay? Yeah. To make it a cable roof, which yeah. will now have this shape. It's Julie from Waterfront. I want to show you the house before we slide in the I-beam. Today's the day where we got a portion of the roof off and in order to prepare for the porch and we're going to slide in the I-beam right there. Everybody, this is Vinny. Vinny's the one controlling the boom truck. Yes. He's doing it from this wonderful remote control, every man's dream. That's right. <laughs> I play games with it. So right now they're putting the beam in the house. Okay. To vault the ceiling. Oh, what does that mean? It's like, so it's like there's no roof, so you know how there's, like you have an attic and it looks like this, but instead it yeah. goes you know, Make the house up, bigger. And it, and it, it has the illusion of making it look more spacious and more bigger. Wow. So how do you feel, Kate? What's going on here? I feel pretty pretty safe. <laughs> this is hardcore, this theme. <laughs> this house is not going anywhere, which I'm pretty pretty stoked about and I think this is realizing the final kind of part of this stage of the project and seeing that we're gonna have these vaulted ceilings is just, yeah, I think it's just gonna be so special. Once that beam is in, it's going to be supported by temporary posts. From that point, we measure from the underside of the beam down to the foundation so we can get the exact measurements for the posts, the real posts. Those are gonna be steel posts that are gonna hold up the steel beam. Those are gonna be welded together, so it's very important that we get the dimensions right. So it currently looks like that beam is just floating in the air. It's being held by temporary posts that are inside the house. What we're gonna do is put a post from the beam down all the way to the foundation. So stay tuned to see what that looks like when we're done.